that you got James Comey, the head of the FBI, runner. Obviously, the guy watches Fox So Called News, right? Fox So Called News came up with this lie that cops are slacking off on their work and crime is exploding all over the country. No, seriously, they had, they've had a, a number of guests on saying this and a number of their hosts have said this. And that lie then, you know, morphed out of Fox so-called news into right wing hate radio, into drudge, into, you know, all the usual suspects. And yeah, there's a couple of cities. Baltimore is one of them where crime is actually up right now. But nationally, there's no upward trend in crime. Nationally, what we're seeing, and 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 nationally, what we're seeing is that crime has been going down steadily since the ni- since the late 1980s. I mean, crime really spiked during the Reagan administration. Now, why is that? Well, it could be that that's when people started losing their jobs. That's when you know factories started moving out of the country. That's when when you know what used to be inner city middle class neighborhoods became inner city poor neighborhoods. You know, the ones that were near factories that no longer exist. Who knows? But crime is going down. There is no Ferguson effect. It does not exist. But you wouldn't know that if you watched Fox so-called news because they live in their own little bubble. Fox so-called news. This is, you know, when Roger Ailes was working for Richard Nixon, there was a proposal that came through the Nixon White House to create something called GOP TV. Roger Ailes marked this proposal all up. There's a whole chapter about this in my book, The Crash of 2016. Roger Ailes marked it all up and said, this is great. We need to do this. Nixon could not raise the money for it. So it, it went into limbo for a decade or more. And finally, well, in, in uh, I think it was 96, the year that the Telecommunications Act was passed that made it possible... Uh, finally, Roger Ailes found his billionaire in the You're Google listening Murdoch. to the Tom Hartman program. Call 202-536-2370. But Fox so-called news, the, the official propaganda arm of the Republican Party, has been peddling this idea that somehow cops aren't doing their job. Sorry, it's got nothing to do with that.